you're not live until I do that, and then I do that, and now I think we are live. Hi. Didn't see you there. <laughs> this is always the lamest start of anything ever. Uh, hello, 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 hello. We are doing a stream, and not only are we doing a stream, but it is we because I have... Our pronouns are we. Our, pro our collective pronoun is we, and uh, we is are. We are is. We currently are. We currently is um, not only me, who is Diane, but also... Sasha. My name's Sasha Swift, and I play musical instruments, and... This is why I'm here, because we both play musical instruments. And we thought, right, we had this theory that if, we, if we're in the same room and played musical instruments together, well, it might, it might be double the fun. Double the amount of music. Um, something that, that scientists have, have discovered is that music is um, uh, objective and not subjective. And so if there are two musicians in the room, there will be twice the amount of music happening at once, which is twice as good as one times the amount of music. Um, in theory, that means if we had three people in the room, it would be three times as good. But unfortunately, the stream isn't. We didn't have the budget. Uh, ah, musician ladies. Yes, absolutely. You're a music lady, even if you're not a musician lady. Actually, I swear that you play something and just haven't told me. But it's all good. Because what we are going to do today is to try and do some kind of funny music. Some amusing We are going to try and write some amusing comedy music because, um... Yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. It's, it's just goofy, goofy, goofy. We like goofy stuff. Um, like, uh... You know um, Sam's obsessed with the, the goofy movie? The goofy movie? The goofy I, movie. I think I... You know what? I've seen it once and it was because we rented it from the video store when I was a kid. I distinctly mm. remember rewinding the videotape. Amazing, amazing, amazing. That's who I am. I've still, I've still somehow not seen it. Um, and I think uh, Sam will probably be very, very upset to find out. But, um, no, we like goofy, goofy, silly, goofy stuff, um, because we are silly, goofy girls. And we wanted to write some comedy music because um, Sasha is very funny and very music, and mm. that seems to make sense. Yeah, I mean, if you go through I'm in a band called Mulk, Sasha Swift and Mulk. If you go through the Mulk discography, you won't find many funny songs because it's one of those things where maybe when I started doing little bits of recording, I'm talking about 13, 14, 15 years ago, I did a bunch of funny songs in a very short space of time. But then it was almost a challenge for me to write serious things. And now that's the kind of thing I'm in the habit of doing is writing things that are like stories or Biographical, autobiographical. Autobiographical. Or they're automatically biographical. They they automatically are if I write them about myself. Yeah. <laughs> and and so it's like, gosh, you you were talking about maybe writing comedy songs. I'm like, yeah, I'm I'm down for that because that's like back to my roots in a way. Um, I've written funny songs. Mm. I I have written funny songs like a long time ago, but I think everything I do now is just all ultra depressing. I did the funny monkey song last week, that was good. Um, but like, normally it's all just like, mm -hmm. endless, endless miserable stuff. Um, which is probably a reflection of me. Um, but, um, I do like funny music. Um, because we were asking, we were thinking like, oh, what, what counts as funny music? And if I had to like, describe funny music in, in like, I don't know, three names. Uh, uh, Weird Al Yankovic. Yankovic? Yankovic? Yankovic. Yankovic. I call him we're, Vic. We're good old Vic. Uh, oh, Vic. Vicky V. The old Vic. Yeah, absolutely. Too much Stephen Wilson, and now I'm sad. And I'm permanently sad. Actually, Stephen Wilson's written funny songs, because he's got... Um, what's the funny one from uh, uh, first Porcupine Tree album? Uh, Lyndon Samuel Dawson. And there is the song that says something... Uh, has the clip of... Uh, something from Up the Downstair, where it's just talking about putting Felix's penis on me or something like that with a uh, with really old-timey tape. Like, Stephen Wilson's music is full of funny stuff, he just doesn't want to talk about it. It's weird. But, I would say, we are Yankovic, Yankovic, good old Vicky V. Um, Tom Waits is like, the funniest musician. 
objectively. Tom Waits is amazing. I really, really like Tom Waits. I picked up a guitar pick because I'm nervous, but I have no use for this. This is just pure nervous Throw habit. It's comedic. Uh, there we go. Um, and uh, there was one other music. Oh, which one for now? Me, obviously. No. Yeah. You, yes. Uh, there was one other. One fourth, we'll add one more. In. Oh, no, I had mentioned that because uh, in prep for this, I went back to. I listened to a lot of Jonathan Colton. Uh, a long time ago. He he did the um, the Portal song. This was a triumph, I'm making a note here, huge success. That's the, the one thing that he's famous for, and the Ikea song. But um, his Artificial Heart album is amazing and really, 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 really good. And the songwriting is just second to none. But this is kind of something that, that you were talking about before, which is that there is a whole load of really, 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 really bad comedy music. Yeah, I mean, it could could be funny if you take away the music, but I think there's there's a, there is a difference between a comedy song which is good because it's funny and because it's good musically, and then there's a lot of songs that are like this is funny, but the music is so disposable. Like if you take away, I mean, a good a good comedy song, you should be able to take away the comedy lyrics writing serious lyrics and it still stand quite well as a song and there's a melody and there's the, a chord structure. The, um, the, the thing that, that, that makes me think of is stuff like uh, like the comedian uh, Dimitri Martin where he will just be finger-picking a chord while he's essentially doing a stand-up set and it's not really a funny song, it's just he is now playing guitar while he does something funny. So you carry on talking, I'm just going to start doing that. Anything. We're, yeah. gonna try, we're gonna try that just to see what happens. Well, I've got to be funny now on cue. Well, no, you don't have to be funny, you've just got to keep talking. Because now, there's a kind of a musical flow to it. Well, once upon a time, there was a deep, dark forest. And in the middle of the forest... <laughs> Why is it a story? I don't know, <laughs> okay. Um, did you ever read the dictionary? <laughs> you just told me to talk. Like I've got no, my, nothing I say could possibly be right here. No, like, but but because there's constant like there's constant like picking going on, it just kind of feel like something's happening all the time. Yeah, it feels so, like feels like we're like arguing over <laughs> mic space, the soundscape. I mean, what is the function of, of this picking sort of vocal offset thing? It's I don't I don't know, but but it kind of feels like. Again, I'm thinking about Dimitri Martin doing it. It kind of feels like it, it, it increases the pace of what's going on. So, if you were just doing an entire set of pure spoke, uh, 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 I was going to say spoken word, but what I really mean is like a, a comedy set of, of spoken word, um, then it would kind of be there's only so much pace you can get into that without trying to do stuff. And right. uh, good spoken word people are really, really, really good at physical comedy, and they would use that to increase the pace of their show. Uh, or again, I'm, th I'm thinking about Dimitri Martin, who like turns his stuff into real presentations, which is really, really cool. Right. But there, just by turning it to a song, it now feels like I can just leave a gap. But I, I would say, you know, God, to write a comedy song, we need a strong relation between the music and the lyrics. Yeah, there's absolutely. The words have to be associated. Absolutely. Um, you know, what I was thinking of earlier. I think I would consider Tenacious D to be a comedy band mm. but if, if you play like the first couple of notes of Tribute everyone knows that and that's not the funny bit is it? No, no, no. That's not the funny bit it's a distinct and original piece of music. Um, is, is this because I'm not actually that familiar is that uh, um, uh, uh, no, no, no. Oh. give yourself an A minor <laughs> Uh, do you want to pick? No, thank you. So well, the, the starting chord of tribute is... And, and the thing is, that song... And, and, and you know, Tenacious D in general, they're not always like completely comedy. You know, not every line is funny. Um, which is, is also very clever. Because... It makes the funny bit stand out. Yeah, and it's it's like... I was thinking of Kickapoo, which is the first track on their second album. It does the opening. Funny. It's well, just the, I mean, a the story. Opening, to be fair, yeah, it, it is uh, just a story, but like, the opening line is a long ass fucking time ago in a town called Kickapoo. <laughs> which is like. There are places called Kickapoo. Is that. That can't be right. It's true. That's like, hilarious. That is hilarious. But no, um, uh, there is. 
there is comedy that is, is good, there is music that is good, and a lot of the time, near the twain shall meet. Mm -hmm. So the real question is, what makes good music and what makes good comedy? And good music is like, okay, uh, we can just go through all of the... Oh yeah, they've got this in uh, B&M. B&M, they've got extra large iron brew. They've got the, the iron brew energy as well. We are going to be super hyper because of this, because this is just like... I'm not whoa. drinking iron brew. <laughs> That's gonna be that just as bad. It's I'm drinking bad. ironic brew. Ironic brew. The um. That's funny. You're funny, but the comedy. Comedy. It's what you're but, here for. Exactly. But when you're uh, trying to write kind of good music, um, that's just kind of general rules. Of music. Music theory can be used to be describe it. All this good stuff. All the stuff I ramble about, like linking chords together, voice leading, all this good stuff. And we comedy can go stuff on forever about. Yeah. What makes a good song? And we will, because this is a 10 hour stream. I know, it looks, it feels like I'm drinking something like, that isn't Iron Brew, but I'm, pro I'm gonna get probably a worse hangover from this because I cannot tolerate any amount of sugar. This is gonna absolutely wipe me out. But, um, when it comes to comedy, like, how do you write good comedy? Because it kind of feels like one of those things where you just do it intuitively. And when anyone says that about music, I'm like, no, it, there are rules. You can, mm, yeah. you can follow those rules or, or kind of subvert those rules to create interesting music. So can you do the same thing with music? No. Can you do the same thing with comedy? I don't know. Yes. Comedy relies on lack of expectation in a way, doesn't it? Or, or lack of um, expectation. What you might not be expecting. That that. Just taking you off guard is funny. Hmm. That's what. That's a good thing, which is uh, you know comedy terminology that you're as a musician aren't as familiar with. That thing. Hmm. Um, a yeah. Thing. Uh, I mean, I'm no. I wouldn't. I wouldn't call myself a comedian. Maybe in another life, I could have been a comedian. Oh yeah, we did this like we we're trying to figure out what to put on the whiteboard, and so we. we I want to put a portal, but Sasha said to turn it into a treble clef, so we did that. But I'm going to get rid of this now because I feel like we can. Like you're talking about expectations. You're talking about expectations. Yeah, yeah. So, um, comedy subjects. Comedy subjects. Because uh, obviously, you know, with with a song, you have a title, and that very much defines generally what the song's about. Whereas, you know, you won't have a comedy routine where someone has a distinct title that summarizes the entire content. But a song being like three minutes in general, you have a title. Hmm. And um, I've had I've had success with funny songs such as. Marmite, because <laughs> no one writes about Marmite, do they? Um, the the uh, the expectations thing. Like, can you just uh, I don't know. Surely you can just like sum it up as if X, then not X. If X, then not X. That is all of the formal logic I can remember from having to do that for a while. But I assume then. Like, we could literally just pick any subject and say, well, what if it was different from the way it should be? In some ways, it's subjects that you shouldn't really have much to talk about. Mm -hmm. Like Marmite. It's Marmite. like, you just put it on things and eat it. We can't, like, we can't do Marmite because you've already, Marmite, you've, already, yeah. you've already, like, like, what's the, you've already cornered the market on Marmite. Um, I don't think there's necessarily a formula that I could think of. I'm taking you off guard, like saying, have you read the dictionary to guitar wankery? That is something we absolutely can do. Um, again, have you read the dictionary? Let's just up the pace while we're talking about it. So as you were saying, just... I lost track of where I was saying. Um, I'm, yeah, the, the, the iron brew is kicking in and I'm just like, like I want to just be doing this all the time now. Unchunk the... <laughs> Surely you can solve that by... Uh, by um, just like putting the peanut butter in a blender. Oh, actually no, but if you do that, is it like hummus where it, just, it gets a really bitter taste? So, no, what I was gonna say is, <laughs> we can just do a song about peanut butter and we can just slowly go through the cat, the breakfast cabinet. We've done, do Marmite, peanut butter, jam, marmalade. No, see, we've gotta, uh, my, my thinking is that if, if you can do a comedy song about anything by taking it and just undermining the expectations, I'm then... I'm looking around your room, sorry. Well, I was going to say, I mean, you're sort of like going to the shop. If we just say shopping... Uh, what, about, what about Tupperware? No one sings about Tupperware, do they? Shopping... Shopping and Tupperware. Shopping for Tupperware. Shopping for Tupperware, yeah. But the problem is this... Um, Let's do the four, because this is cool. Um, 
thing is, the, the danger is it kind of feels like it turns into lol so random type stuff. Ra am so random. Exactly. I am so random. Im so random. Im so random. Im so random. Um, Raw. Rabbit, rabbit with a pancake on his head. But like, if you do that, then that's kind of becomes like, okay, well, it's shocking with Tupperware on its own. If that is funny, because it's just not something you do that much, then... <laughs> um... <laughs> That's exactly what uh, person. See, that's a, that's a good example because in Personal Shopper by Stephen Wilson, the the long middle section is read out by. Who is it read out by? For some reason, my brain is saying, "Oh my god, the I, the brain is getting the wrong '70s entertainer." Definitely the wrong '70s entertainer. Elton John. Elton John. It's read out by Elton John, and the very first line, because it's a song about, uh, an ironic song about how everyone just wants to buy everything. The very first thing he says, oh, you can buy this, is um, uh, uh, designer sunglasses. Elton John is famous for wearing fancy sunglasses. So that's, that is a joke in and of itself. So, like, yeah, I think comedy music doesn't have to be devoted to being comedy music. Um, another one that springs to mind is Cat Food by King Crimson, which is just about going to the shop and buying cat- There you go! Going to the shop and buying cat food and eating it. And it's really, 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 really funny and silly, but actually it's a really cool piece of music as well. It's like a well-designed piece of music. So anyway, if we use shopping food- you talk, you talk, you talk. Yeah, yeah, you mentioned Weird Al yeah. as well. Parody is another thing, and that, that um, sort of cuts out the need for an original tune that's good, because you're already, presumably, using someone's tune because you think it's good. True, but then, like, now you've gone back to, well, we don't need interesting mu musical composition, it's just, use this thing. This no, I'm thing. saying it's like, it's valid. It's a valid, because, you know, but we're not going to do that. Mm. But it is valid. It is valid, but, like, uh, trying to come up with something interesting that kind of fits together, it feels like kind of quite a, quite a nice challenge. So if we just kind of, like, take Shopping for Tupperware, you can't just be like, here's the joke, and now write an entire song about Shopping for Tupperware. So, as we're doing this, um, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just trying to fill in the gap, but, um, I feel like in order to make this joke last for three minutes instead of, um, uh, just kind of be, basically being a one-trick pony. What do you do with the Tupperware? Well, this is it, this is it. There, there, there are five, like vital, the locks. five vital questions that I, I believe, I'm convinced that there is, uh, that this was from like Spy Kids or something when I was super young, but something like these questions. Who, what, when, where, why? There we go. Um, I have like a song learning these questions that stuck in my head and it has been for about 25 years now. Um, so, if we're shopping for Tupperware, we need a who because we need some kind of protagonist that everyone can empathise with. The this, who, everyone loves the who. Everyone loves the who, but we can't be the who shopping because that feels like, a, again, a little bit of a lol so random. So we need, like, someone who is going to go, whether that's I, the... the I'd like, always go for I. Yeah, I. Um, so in that case, that's just... It's just who I am. Um, autobiographical. Do we, sorry, do we write me or we, we for this then? I'm gonna write I. I, yeah. There we go. I. I referring to you in this case. No, or is it you referring to. Uh, anyway, what? Okay, shopping for Tupperware, that could be the thing. I think that, that that's the, the title, so I'm just gonna write that. I feel like it's the same thing. Um, when is useful, because now we can, we can establish a time period for it. Why is it always the we? Why is it. We? Brought the wrong bananas. Um, that just feels funny on its own. How do you buy wrong bananas? Yeah, bananas are bananas! Song. That's a song. Is it? Is it yeah. a song? Oh, okay. It's a comedy song. I don't, I don't know, I don't know. It's called I Brought the Wrong Bananas. Oh, I, I bought the, the wrong I, bananas. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, like, if we go for, like, the when and the where and the why, um, there's, like, three... If we go for the when, you can either make this an aspirational trip to buy Tupperware, or we can travel back into the past to one of our many past trips to the shop to buy Tupperware. And then, like, both of those... I mean, you can explore both of these. What if, then, it's, uh... Um... We, like, have a verse that is gonna be... I went to the shop to buy Tupperware. And then the second verse that is gonna be... 
explore on the other side of it. We can kind of just explore different mm. different sides of it. I would I would say on the other hand, you know, like it's like I was in this situation. Then you start you really have to start putting specifics in, and that's where I would sort of be like, God, that's a lot of effort. Yeah, well, the when feels difficult to, to like split up. But the where feels like there's more, it would be easier to do this with, um, I feel like there's one joke in when, but with where, you'd be like, okay, first you do it at the store. And if you buy Tupperware at the store, then where else would you buy Tupperware that is not the store? Go. You're, you're, you're floundering under the pressure. Where else would you buy Tupperware? You could steal it. Amazon. You could, you could get it on, mm, yeah, okay. We've got, from the shop. Uh, verse one. You know, I'd rather write a song about a three-pin plug. A three-pin plug? Yeah, um, like, with my three-pin plug. And then you could have lines about... Oh, no, I wrote on the wrong one. That should be... Lines about voltage and... Voltage. See, this, I feel like that's got, like, more avenues in some mm, ways. I'm, 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 in, I'm in love with shopping for Tupperware, to be honest. Um, we... Where? Okay. Uh, verse one is at the shop. Verse two, where else do you require Tupperware? Well, you could steal it. Like from elsewhere. Or what do you do with the Tupperware? Hmm? Or what do you do with the Tupperware? Well, that's the why. That's the why. So then, if there's like a. Uh, I don't think you can get a verse 3 out of this. I feel like verse 1 and 2 is probably everything we need. Possibly. I, um, I want to know what's being put in the Tupperware okay. and why it's so unusual. Does that mean that's going to be like a chorus thing? Is that going to be like a. like a, a the, the, the main reason we're, we're trying to acquire this Tupperware? Tupperware. Because uh, I used to out what is. Well, it's Tupperware, so that, that's kind of inherent with, with everything we're doing. Um, when we can we can figure out, but the why I think that's got that's got to be a chorus. Um, now, so oh here, now here we go. Looks like the Borso dog. The, hmm? the what? The Borso dog. The Borso dog. Borso. Let uh, me do it for you. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. It's a percentage. Wait, wish.com. Uh, see the oh Yeah, God. yeah. Okay. Wish.com for Tupperware. Buying online, that feels that feels like, I don't think there's a whole joke in itself there, but it feels like that is something you could fix into, you, you could like incorporate into buying, into like maybe buying at a shop. Because here we're really thinking about buying, here we're thinking about stealing or something like that. Or making, I don't know. Um, but the, uh, the when, I don't think you can get a verse out of it because it feels like such a dramatic change to say we've got a, 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 a Tupperware, no, we're buying, we need Tupperware for one thing now, like this is a present need or maybe even a future need, I'm going to do the thing. Whereas in the past, those halcyon days, back when we used to have Tupperware, and not just Tupperware, but Tupperware with lids. Tupperware that we could rely on. Tupperware that America could rely on. I don't know why I said America because this is clearly, this is not my, my finest American accent, but like that kind of stupid stuff. That feels like there is a, there is a drive there for, uh, for like a particular reason for doing it. And then if we kind of go to the when, if we're dealing with musical structure, this is like a middle eight thing. Back in the day, this is where everything changes. The whole vibe changes. This is a uh, call a bridge. So I think when we're trying to do this, we need uh, some kind of structure. Um, we're going to come straight in on a verse. I've got a chorus. You got a chorus. You got a chorus. Never enough Tupperware. Cool chorus. Because there is this true, isn't it? You you'll buy Tupperware, fill uh, a few things up, and then you need to put something in Tupperware, and you find there's no more Tupperware. Where does it go? Where does it go? It's all being used, it? or you've lent it to no, someone. No, no, or... because, because we haven't done any of those things. We didn't do any of those things, and it's still gone. Where did it go? Where did it that's the go? That's the hook, isn't it? This is the issue. This is the issue that, that I'm that's so upset lyric. about. That's the lyric. Yeah, where did it go? Where did it go? That's a hook. Yeah, yeah absolutely. That's, that's a hook we need. So we've got our chorus there. So, verse and chorus. But, I don't think we can just say verse 1, chorus. I think what we need is... Uh, uh, oh, sorry, I've stolen it, I've stolen it. Um, what we need, could you just like fill the space in? I like that kind of like uh, the... Um, uh, the da, 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 da. Sounds like... Uh, there's like a name for that, uh, uh, that particular chord progression. A minor, G, F sharp, F. As a name for it, I don't know. The Lion Cliche? I don't know. Just feels like, uh, I mean, I think of uh, Ice Cream Man by Tom Waits or Hit the Road Jack. Uh, the, uh, 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 why is that not doing the thing? Oh no. 
I want to hear the thing. I want to hear the thing. I broke the thing. Let me remove that back over here. She broke the thing. There we go. There we go. That thing. Uh, a minor, G, F, E. Like kind of, oh, like, the Andalusian like kids. a little bit of a comedy cliche. Uh, well, maybe, but it, but it doesn't really matter at the minute. We can, we, can, we can build up to it. But the thing is, I don't think we can get away with verse straight to a chorus, because you give the hook away too soon. So instead what we need is a verse which sets up the expectations, and then we need, I think, immediately verse 2. Verse 1, verse 2. Possibly with a bridge between these, then a bridge, then a chorus, then the middle, middle, then a chorus, and that's and that's that's us. That's the whole song. We've, one. we've clearly never written a song together, have we? No, no. We, we, we've not. got very different approaches. I think. How I've do you? How, how, how would you do this? How would you do this? I instinct it, really. Instinct it, because that's what I don't like. Because I have no instincts at all. I'm right. completely. Okay. There is nothing. There is nothing between these ears except like a like a chasmous void of silence. So. But at the same time, like, you're, you're a music teacher, you, this is what you do, you're... Exactly! So I'm inclined to trust you, but I'm like, this is unfamiliar territory. But this so is... This we're going to learn together now. This, is, this is it. There, there is nothing in my head. There, there is nothing but silence in my head. So when I try and write music, um, what I really, really want is some kind of like structure or system. So now, we're thinking about how to write a verse, how to write a chorus, and how to write a middle section. Now that, like, three sections of music I can do, I cannot do a whole song, but I can do three sections. So, four sections if we're doing a bridge as well. So, um, verse one is shop. Shop. Yeah. Right. This is our, our, our first attempt to buy the Tupperware. Verse two, what changes? What, what, what is the, the, the subverted expectation? Well, we said before, okay, well, it's not going to work, so we're going to, like, steal or something, but, like, go burglarizing houses or something like that. Um, Why haven't they got Tupperware? They don't have Tupperware. Why is it funny? There's none. Someone, someone bought all the Tupperware. Someone got their fur. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. So, we're going to start to get Tupperware. There is no Tupperware. I think, I think, I feel like that we can get a verse 3 in here. Maybe a chorus, verse 3, middle section chorus. Just to get to repeat this verse cycle. Uh, let's get uh, verse three. There we but go. You're, you're so much more. You've got a very specific organized. approach. Yeah, yeah absolutely, that I, absolutely. I would not do. I would not do it like this. Hmm. I'm, I'm totally on board for it. But it's oh, just it's like, always, I'm, I'm going right, to observe for a little bit. Cool, cool, cool. So we've kind of got this structure, and now we can start actually writing. Uh, well, I think chorus. Where did it go? We've got, we've got that sorted out. The middle section. Um, I remember having Tupperware. This is going to be like remembering your lost love. Right. Um, yeah, that's good. I remember. Because that gives us the I. We, we're going to be voicing our opinion on a lot of the stuff across the verse. So, so why, why I, are you coming up with the topic, like the lyrics then? Uh, who cares? Who cares? No, no you've, you've, got, you've not got the instinctual approach to the chords or the structure. No, no not at all. Got... So, so what I'm thinking here is we've got the topics now. And now we can kind of we're essentially exploring this thing. So, like I, we know that all the verses are going to be from the first person perspective. We're going to be exploring this character's uh, response to, first of all, going to the shop, right. being pissed off that there's nothing there, with this character's anger, thinking, where did it all go? I, I've not done anything with this, where did it go? I'm obviously being like somewhat facetious about this, but like, I think that that's. You can still flush out a character, like even in a comedy song, that, that, that is the motivation, and we do need a motivation. So, uh, uh, the kind of middle section, like having a character be nostalgic. Um, I mean, obviously, the the, the, the kind of the, the thing is that this is um, the nostalgia is selling it for me now. Yeah, it, it's yeah. O it's overselling. You know, you wouldn't actually feel this dramatic about it, but but that's again, you would normally think about this for I don't know a lost love or something. But the fact that we, we're now essentially equating that with Tupperware misattribution. Yeah, misattribution. Can, there we go. Yeah. Is that a word for it? Cool, cool. That's so, that's really good comedy. But this is it, so we've, we've kind of like, there's a kind of a structural approach for it to deliberately explore who, what, when, where, and why. Rather than instinctively doing it where, for me, I tend to miss stuff if I, if I wing it. Whereas if I do this, it's, it's a little bit more reliable. Now, I'm thinking musically, because what I want to do here is for the middle section, I know that I want a key change. Uh, it has to be a key change. 
uh, or maybe just like uh, from the minor, she's the major or something like that. But the middle section is going to be musically going to a different place. Uh, are you trying to read that? Uh, yeah, I, like, I've got contact lenses I, in and they're not I, as strong as my glasses. So I I'm think like, I can make this bigger. Hold on. Uh, what does it say? Hold on. I bet I can make this bigger. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see if we can save our ailing eyesight. Uh, there we go. Uh, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is a sign of age, isn't is it? That, is that a bit better? It's, it's totally better, yeah. Yay, cool, cool, cool. So, um, cool, cool, oh, cool. actually, does that mean that it doesn't look... No, it looks fine, it looks fine. So, we've got this kind of, like, structure now. So I think now, uh, we've, we've been running for half an hour now. Like, this is, like, a lot of... We've, we've, we've put a lot of thought into uh, how we're doing this. We've not really written very many jokes. You've put thought in. I've just been like, yeah, this is a good <laughs> idea. I'm, I'm validating. So, so what, what we're going to have to deal with here is, is um, how fast are you at writing, by the way? Because I think it's... Shit, the bad. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Cause so um, in that case, if we are like... We're going to have to type some stuff out. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to grab that. Uh, I'm going to grab Word. this. Word, absolutely. So here we go. There we go. Oh no, I did the wrong thing. Oh, uh, there we go, there we go. I'm gonna start picking, is your... Yeah, absolutely, by all means. So, now we've got this. Uh, how long is the verse gonna be? Well, I'm gonna say uh, two lots of four lines. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Again, I want structure here. You can't see this. I'm gonna move this over so we can, we can see it. Um, that's gonna be here. There we go. So there, you should be able to see everything that we... Ooh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, that shouldn't be there. There we go. Cool. I've just closed the thing I needed, so I'm going to open that back up. But while I'm doing it... There we go. Cool, cool, cool. Don't do that. There we go. Cool. So now, we've got, like, verse one here, essentially. This is how I want to think about everything. Oh, cropped out. Um, you cropped out? Oh, let me fix this. What are you doing? Just uh, let me just fix it. Uh, no, I'll just lean forwards. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure I can fix it. Hold on. Uh, there we Hello, go. Hello, I'm here too. There we go, hold on. I can move Shh. that. The world's crumbling. Hey! You're oh my goodness, there's even, there's even more there. Fun with the uncropping, aren't you? Oh, I'm having a whale of a time. A whale of a time. There we go. Cool. I think that's probably best down here. Cool. So. Now that we've got this, um, again, I want to have like a, like a clear structure for the whole thing. So we know that verse one, we need to convey in eight lines of dialogue, um, I am going to the shop to buy some Tupperware. Um, I think we do need to establish the motive early. I think we can establish, we can explore it in the chorus, but the motive, I'm going to the shop to buy some Tupperware. So you, you, you go lyrics first? Well, yeah, we can we can we can kind of wing it wing it with the uh, the the chords in a minute. But like, if we've got lyrics, then we can start looking for a a vocal. Unless you'd like to start start with some uh, chords. Just go for it, go for it, get winged. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that works. What was that? G, G D, e, e minor. E minor. Is that G? E minor. E minor. Lovely. D. Oh, so close. There we go. Cool, cool. Um, so, now there's like an in in inherent sadness to this because we've got a whole lot of minor chords going on. Um, is that what we want for this? Because we're, this is this is like a, a hopeful journey. I feel like that, we, that B minor to the D is... We're, we're, going, we're going to the shop to buy some Tupperware. Um, the, the funny shitty city in Britain, Middlesbrough, <laughs> Middlesbrough is shit. Um, the funny, the funny Britain places, um, uh, what's the funniest rubbish place? Uh, the funniest rubbish place in Britain. Oh no, don't do that. There Those chords could work for the uh, chorus. Yeah, possibly. I think we can put a pin in it. But what I'm thinking is this needs to be uplifting, which means we need to use a four chord to a five chord, which means I would say we need a uh, 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 let me have a think. It's true. Uh, uh, um, A to a G. A to a G. Nice. Excellent. That works. Because if we just vamp that, A to G, A to G. It's got like a sense of movement to it, which is what, what we're trying to do. We're, we're going to a shop. You just played something really, really cool. I don't know what it was. Middlesbrough, no one wants to go there. Middlesbrough, Middlesbrough is bad, but there are worse cities than Middlesbrough. Um, Derby isn't good. 
Um, Leicester isn't good. Um, well, we're thinking Midlands here. There are worse places than the, this is hard to believe for some people. There are worse places in the Midlands. Where is worse in the Midlands? Warsaw. 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 Yeah. Warsaw. How do you even say? Is that Walsall? Walsall. You just say Warsaw, but maybe that's my accent. I, I can't tell if this is Walsall or W A L S A W L. Well, yeah, 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 okay, cool, Warsaw. So, we can... Warsaw? Oh, that's in Poland. That's a different place. Um, although I suppose that'd be a very different... That'd be a very different uh, journey to the shop. But, here's the problem, is that if we if we use that super early to set the location, um, I think I think there's a joke in that. What rhymes with Warsaw? Warsaw, Warsaw... Uh, I think we can, we can figure it out. But the thing is, if we use that immediately to be like, hello, I'm going to the shop in Warsaw, I think that's going to be... It, it, it's going to kind of like... Um, morsel. That's good. A morsel of food. Which would be in the Tupperware. Um, but I think if we, use, if we use that joke too soon, you, you've kind of just presented it as a fact instead of using it as like a, ha-ha, this whole time we were in Warsaw. So, verse one. We've got the chords. Um... We need a way to get uh, this kind of stated. So, uh, if you want to swing some chords, I like the A to G thing because it's got the sense of motion. Turn that E. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What is it? A G E. Yeah. Can, there's hope here. We, we can get to the shop and buy the Tupperware. So, um, I don't think we can get away with we're going to the shop to buy some Tupperware. Um, I think that that needs to be the payoff to the first verse. Um, I think that um, we need to explain that we're getting something very important here. Um, we need to explain what where we're going and that we're getting something important and then we reveal that it's Tupperware around here. What maybe? about, oh god, or, or it could be the situation. The situation. Yeah, like, uh, god, no, no, no. I'm so sick of putting stuff in clean film. It's wasteful. Well, well, I like it, but I think that's verse two. Because I think what we need to do is explain how serious the situation is before we reveal that. And then we're sort of like, like we, we, Birmingham is shit. Birmingham's shit. I'm from Birmingham. It did no, but it is it is rubbish though, isn't it? Uh, all I'm saying, all I'm saying. It has its moments. It has its good bits. It has its bad bits. It's a big city. Big cities are gonna have <laughs> sort of the most extremes, aren't they? So what you're saying is the inherent nature of Birmingham. It's not overall shit, you've just been to the shit bits. That is true, actually. I don't like the central of Birmingham. Uh, but no, the central of Birmingham's good. No, it's just... Yeah, no, yeah, absolutely. So, um, so what we need to do, the very first bit is going to be like, this is going to be um, set the tone as serious. Um, uh, pay, payoff is Tupperware. Yeah, it's going to come up. Nottingham's going to be in there. Nottingham's going to be in there. Um, Maybe we should do. Um, we should do a song about the shittest city in Britain. <laughs> uh, shitty verse... city, shitty city. <laughs> uh, verse two is going to be um, right. uh, talking about Tupperware. What uh, Tupperware? That sounds like you know my generation. Yeah, yeah. I hear that. Talking about yeah. my Tupperware. Uh, <laughs> um, then I think verse three is going to be like that, that kind of ceiling again, kind of thing. So, um, we need to set the tone of seriousness. Uh, we need to convey... Is this that, mic on? Uh, I think it's currently muted. Good, it probably should be. Uh, yeah, the recording glass is muted. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that was why it wasn't working out. That makes sense. So, um, we have got uh, to set the tone as serious uh, to talk about loss. Oh, no, 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 we're, we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna, we're gonna get it back. We're gonna get something back, something back. but we're not gonna. We're not gonna. Yeah, we're gonna okay. Um, if you just le leave those chords looping. In fact, we could just track that now if you want to. Um, do you want a click? Uh, I better have a click, haven't I? Do yeah. I need phones? Cameras. Uh, there's gonna be. Uh, there we go. 
Uh, if you just pick a tempo and I'll, I'll match it. There we go. Tap, 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 tap. Can it be ready? Cool. Give me a second to get the thing going. Can you just give me a strum? Keep going, keep strumming, keep strumming, keep strumming. Keep going, keep strumming. Cool, okay. I want to start again, sorry. Yeah, go for it, go for it, go for it. <laughs> I'm like this. Nice, excellent. So we've now got that. I'm going to pull that into time. Just to get it there. Cool. Now this is basically our intro. Oops, uh, uh, intro. I think that I'm just gonna copy and paste this over this way. There we go. And then this is the beginning of verse one. Verse one, there we go. Um, that is the end of that loop. Oh, I could have played better, I'm sure. No, it doesn't matter, we're just songwriting, we're just songwriting. I forget that, yeah, this isn't the production, is no, it? No, this is just, um... just songwriting. Cool, so we've got that. I'm gonna just make a new track so we've got it. Um, Acoustic guitar, there we go. Um, this will be vocals, here we go. Um, we're going out to get get some stuff. Uh, we're going out to, what are we doing? We're going out to get some stuff. Um, keep talking. We're going out to get some stuff. What are we trying to do here? We've, got to, we've got to explain that we're going to the shop, but we don't want to give away what we're getting. We want to feel like we're going to like, we're about to like, leave. Caught like, the bus. Uh, caught the bus, caught the tram, caught the... Caught the disease. Yeah, we go. No, 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 no. No, we're catching several modes of transport because we're going on a journey here. Caught the bus. Caught the tram. Uh, took a plane. Caught the took bus. Tram. I caught the tram. Caught. There we go. Took a plane. I took the pram. Took the pram. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know. Impl you're introducing a baby, or some. Yeah, it, or, you're, or you're implying I, 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 I carry a pram around with no baby in it. Yeah, the, the, I think the, the, the joke here is that we 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 tra our, our mode we of transportation was pram. It's worth. Hmm. It's an empty pram. They need a pram's worth of Tupperware. Pram's worth of pram. Mm, possibly to, uh, to complain. And as tram, is there a, is there a bit of light? <laughs> no. no, no. I think this, this is just me winging it. Uh, uh, took a pram. Um. Yeah, literally, literally. It's, uh, I had to, I had to travel from here to the next city over. I used to have to get a bus, walk for a while, get a train, walk for ages to get a bus, to walk for ages to get to this place. It was about an hour and 40 minutes that now takes me half an hour by car. Ridiculous. I, um, I had to once go from Brisbane in Australia down the Gold Coast to, I think, I think it was just Byron Bay and I couldn't get the train from the train station because they have different rail gauges. They're literally different sized, what do you call them, wheels? Do, you, mm. do trains have wheels? I don't know, they've got like... Am I thinking of they've got, tread? No, they've got some kind of wheel. They've got some kind of wheel. Wheels. Oh. Wheeled. Yeah, I took, well, if we set this in Brisbane, um, <laughs> I, took, I took a train, I took a train. But then you just have to guess that they're different gauge trains. I don't think you can really... Hold on. Tram plan? Uh... Plane... Took... Two more buses... Um... Something... something plan? Something, uh... You're shoving a lot of words in there, aren't you? Yeah, I always write too many, too many words when I, when I write lyrics. Caught a plane... caught a bus, caught a tram, took a plane... Um... I feel like there's a joke. We, we need to make a joke within these first few lines. It can't be. It can't be just. And I think like no, the repetition I, I, I don't is think it. this ne is necessary. I think that's where people sometimes actually go wrong. Okay. Why don't you have too many jokes in? A uh, Birmingham. 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 Took a plane to Birmingham, which is yeah. funny because who would like get a plane to Birmingham? That's good. So we, we don't have to do any work here. We've Absolutely, this is the yeah. goal. What, I, what, what, I'd, what I'd like, this is the best thing. You, you, you now you get. Have, you have to pronounce the ham though. Birmingham. In fact, because I'm a Brummie, I would say Birmingham. Birmingham. 
I'm from Birmingham. 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 I'm like Liverpoolian then. Well, I, they're all the same. They're all the, they're literally the same <laughs> city. They're exactly the same city. So, um, that works because that like. You say we don't need a joke, but actually, having a joke in there is is good. I'm the joke. So, we're setting the tone of serious. Um, took plane to Birmingham. Um, we're still traveling. Are we still traveling here? We're still in the, the first stanza here, so we're still traveling. Um, I don't know. I, whatever lyrics come to me, I will work that out. So, yeah, so what, what do you got? What do you got? We're going to just leave this looping, to be fair. Though. It's, I caught the bus, I caught the tram, I took a plane to Birmingham. Something like that, I don't know. There's no point. We could just, yeah, that could just be vocal vocalisms to be fair. Uh, I'm still feeling like we, we'd be better to get like uh, one more line in here. Um, what have we got? What are you thinking? If you're if you're instincting, what 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 do we need to do with this? I, I, I'm, I'm I'm it's hard because I know I've got to think. Mm. But also, we're streaming, so, so we've, got to, think, we've got to look think interesting while we do it. Absolutely. Um, yeah. So what I'm thinking is we, we we need to like try and set the tone of serious. Took a plane to like Birmingham. Anyway, I'll make it there. Cool, cool. Um, uh, uh, Anyway, I'll make it there. Anyway, I'll make it there. Um, anyway, I'll make it there. Something, something. I don't know. I'd get rid of the is there. Well, yeah, and that's a question. Is there any way I'll make it there with this great problem, with the burden that I bear? I don't, I don't know. That's, that's... Yeah, uh... uh burden, that, burden that I bear. So replacing that, is there any... Um, anyway, I'll make it there uh, to shed this burden that I bear. Uh, See, I think someone's gonna stick with it if they're listening. Mm, mm. And you're not you're not jumping into the joke. Apart from Birmingham, you mentioned Birmingham. Mm, so. mm. Yeah, I think I think yeah, the setup has got to be on a quest for tougher work. Actually, I like I like that because that gives us the uh, anyway. I'll make it that it gives us repetition. Um, I want a quest for. Because that gives us like we've now paid that off as like the whole. That's thing. pretty good. So I, that I, does work. Did you just come up with that? No, 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 no. no. Uh, Pike did. Pike did. Well, Pike's uh, just writing the whole song at this. Yeah, point. absolutely. Yeah, that's the goal. That's really the end goal of this thing is to get get Pike doing all the work. Um, I yeah. So, so that's uh, not. That's not our fault. You just happened to really like. <laughs> really, uh, yeah. Absolutely. Really, yeah. really good. Really good. So, is, it, oh, is this still going through? Sir? Is this still going through? I might be really uh, loud. Possibly, possibly. It doesn't matter. It's... Hello? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Uh, Paging. Does that Hello. still come through? I think that should be fine. Should be fine. Ah. Cool. So, uh, we've got this, we've got this. Uh, we have. Um, I caught the bus, I talked with the pram. Uh, talk with the tram, took a plane in Birmingham. Anyway, I'll make it there, show this person that over there. Um, what else can we catch? Perfect. <laughs> oh, that, that would date it, wouldn't it? Um, these two, we've got this like A, A, B, B kind of rhyming thing. So I think we've got to maintain that at least for now. Um, so we need two lines to essentially say, um, there is a hole in my heart. There is a hole in... There's something funny there though, isn't there? A hole, there is a hole in the heart that I wear. Oh no, no, because that's going to... There's a hole in... Put a lid on it. Yeah. I need uh, to put a lid on the hole in my heart. I need to put a lid on the hole in my heart. Um, no, my heart has a hole that needs a lid. That's, my, that's good. My oh, I'm, I'm heart on it, am I? has a hole that needs a lid. Uh, my heart needs a lid. Um, my heart, the heart remembers what the oven did. There we go. The heart remembers what the oven did. See, it's stupid, but it works. Um, the heart remembers what the oven did. Because that's just like a, a kind of a, a, you know, so. Now, my thinking is, this is currently all major chords. Can we swap the A, the A for an A minor? I want to see what that, that sounds like. 
Um, I, want, I, want, I want this to feel more serious, and then we can... Hey, you, you said major chords, you said major chords. Yeah, I was thinking the, the A to G, because I wanted that, that kind of progress. If I, if I play an E minor too, yeah. But I no, that's, super, that's, super, that's super dark, though. Well, I'm thinking we, we can lift this up for verse 2. Or just an E minor with... so it's like... No, I... Oh, what, what if you play the E major? Uh, a minor, G, E major. It's the tone. Yeah, if I, if I was doing an E minor and an A minor, I would. Yeah, probably. yeah. Um, can you play an A sus just without the uh, the top? Yeah, go for it, go for it. Yeah. No, just uh, open, open, two, two, open, open. See, I. A, a minor without a pointer. A minor without a pointer. Yeah, like that. Go for, yeah, go for it. Yeah, perfect. Right. Yeah. I don't know the names <laughs> of some of these chords. I know how to play them. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. I did the E minor instinctually there. That's yeah, the work, it's the work, it's the work. It's got a ringing about it, hasn't it? What's well, the. Yeah. But the thing is, that's. um... That's good, that's good. The, the That A sauce is hitting a B there, so if we can if we can hit it's a bit that. Sus, isn't it? If we can hit either a B or a G over the A, uh, if you can. I've got the thing here. Uh, I caught a bus. Can you play the A again? Caught a bus. Caught a bus. I caught the tram. Caught a bus. I caught the tram. Play it again. I caught a bus. I caught the tram. I took a plane to Birmingham. I miss one of that. I'm trying to anyway, harmonize. Uh, in the burn, that high bear. Oh, yeah, that we need a high point, an obvious high point in the mouth. You always need that. Well, so you over serious the song, you know. It's like slow it down a bit. Like. What, what? True. Yeah, it gives you like a Johnny Cash if you, if you, vibe. Yeah, try giving try giving us that there. You ready? What? Give me a. What, do you want? Do you want a click on or? Uh, no. Let's let's, let's free time for now. How fast do you want it? Uh, nice and slow, like you were saying. Seven, which is like the F. Sorry, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Play the F chord and then leave the top E string open. Oh, in fact, just just play the F bar chord, but don't don't play anything except the first, the, the low E. Uh, so unbar everything. Uh, yes, exactly that, exactly that, exactly that. Just 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 uh, if you just strum that and then just leave it ringing. Oh, sorry. I don't know what you're going for here, but this is how you work, isn't it? It's yes, like, absolutely I'm how I work. I'm talking over it. Great. I didn't realise. Give, give, give it a strum. Nice. So there, what this gives us is a... Uh, I know what you're going for, Sally. Yeah, we, we want some kind of variation here. I'm just going to try and pull this together. Yes, exactly, exactly. And you say it's very emotional, that's the goal, because I want it to be feel uplifting when we when we reprise this. There. There, we zoom in. There we go. Have a listen. Yeah, see there we go. So Th that needs a little bit of adjusting. I could just record the whole thing if you want. Well, I think the goal is to we'll just kind of hack it together and we'll figure it's it out. It's a demo, now. isn't it? So yeah, exactly, exactly. So it's to dem demo and straight. Uh, that's what so, we call that demo. So, so that sound like uh, I can't, I can't. I want the the the, the sustain there. I can't the bus. I can't the tram. Ooh. If a plane to Birmingham. Cool. 
Cool. Okay. So now we need to yeah, let's just let's just put that together. This is obviously going to have some bleed in it, but that's fine. So if I get that mic doing the same thing, uh, now. Sorry, this is this is really cool. This is not how I would do it, but it's working really, really well. Yeah, this is how I this is how I do everything. Uh, this is like how I like to write. So now, if we just try and try and wing this, uh, one, two, one. Doing? We're just gonna sing the first verse again. Uh, do you want to do it? Do you want the mic? Uh, just just do both exactly the same way we just did. If you want to like lean toward that mic or point it towards you, or something. Like, again, we don't care about the quality of this at all, but as long as it like comes out right. Here we go. Ah, oh, it's got a it's super in. I caught, I caught the bus, I caught the tram, took a plane to Birmingham, anyway I'll make it there, to shed this burden that I bear. There. That is where we're going to repeat this. Uh, because this is still in the emotional yeah, zone. Just, you let it ring and then it'll come in and, yeah. and if you have I'm That's obviously too loud. It's way too loud. Oh, why did I do that back in vocal? That sounds hilarious. I love it. Maybe if you add a bit of reverb to my voice. There we go. So that works really nicely. Now we've got the, the, the melody here. My heart has a hole and needs a lid. So I think what we need to do is try to um, um, is try to uh, change our chord progression here. Uh, can we go uh, uh, A? Oops. Uh, heart has a hole that needs a lid. Heart has a hole that needs a lid. Um, oops. F G um, F G uh, major seven. So that's going to be something like uh, if I borrow that for a second, that would be something like borrow it. It's yours. Yay! I've been free guitar. It. Free guitar. Oh. Um, so my heart. My, my, heart has a, my heart has a hole that needs a lid The heart remembers what the oven did And anyway I'll make it clear I'm on a quest for Tupperware So there, I mean this is kind of like the bridge thing, this is what I wanted here um, So that is now, really, I, I'm, I'm thinking about this as, as, as bridge one. But you can see, like, now we've got, like, a structural build here. Rather than condescending the listener as if we don't, as if we're doing the same thing. So, uh, as if they don't understand what we're doing here. There we go. Um, so now we're just gonna play the exact same thing again. Oh, sorry, uh, th that just, if we just track that very quick. Um... What am I doing? Um, if you just have a go strumming those chords, you might want to get the mic on you. Uh, there we go. The tone match doesn't matter at all. Uh, oh, I'm yeah, it's fine. Right. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Go for it. Go for it. Nice. So there. We've now got that, uh, I didn't need that, we just need this one, there we go. So we pull this together, uh, that was the copy and paste. So we pull this in. The lovely people at home can't see this, can they? they just... uh, oh, they can't, you're right, there we go. Uh, I think I'm just gonna copy and paste one of these, so we've got... Start to sound it's that. gotta have a dramatic solo. Well that's that's what I'm thinking here, because we need a bit of run up to get to this. There we go. So if you want to solo over that. Um, I need to hear it. First, yeah, 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 just give me a second. Oops. No, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. I broke it, I broke it, I broke it. Um solo. Um if you come in on this, there we go, here we go. 
So we've got that, and that's immediately going to beget the uh, the second verse, which is... Totally beget it. Oh, it's going to go hard, it's going to go hard. Begets and begetting. I love begets. Begets are yummy. So we've now, begetting. Got, we've now got the second verse, which is, this is where the payoff is. I'm going to go to the top where I think uh, this actually needs to, to uh, um... Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. Can I get an A chord? Can you just give me an A chord right now? Just big A chord. <laughs> Yeah, the biggest A chord, the biggest A chord. <laughs> Shitting you out. Then. You're psyching me out, you're psyching me out. Ready? Uh, oh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. The comedy has... The comedy is at my expense. The comedy is at my expense. <laughs> ah, as it so often is. As it so often is. Give us the A chord, give us the A chord. That's good enough, that's good enough. Fuck it. Why are you laughing? So, I laugh because you're winding me up. <laughs> you thought I was gonna wind you up? No, you are winding me up. I'm not winding you up. I love it, I love it, I love it, I'm here. I'll here we go. Yeah, you asked me to play an A, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a, A, A. Here we go, here we go, here we go. That should feel like a, a um. Here we go. So, that, uh, are we good for verse? Are we good, How have you first? done this before? Digital audio workstation. Pen and paper. Pen and paper. Right, but then you're using the audio, the audio recording as well, a really firm basis, though. Well, that's fine. I mean, you can accompany, so I'll, I'll probably be playing. Uh, um, uh, I'll be playing. These are valid questions. Um, no, uh, yeah, I would play. Uh, my heart. Uh, my heart. Uh, Would you have like recorded on your phone or something? Maybe as a demo or like a tape recorder? Uh, like for I don't know. I, I I wouldn't really know. Uh, I think generally uh, just piano. Did, it, uh, did you always have the software to support your writing? Uh, I did. Yes. I've just realised I need to be uh, saving this before it gets like deleted by like a power cut or something. Here we go. That is. Uh, this is called Tupperware. Uh, Tupperware, uh, one, four, two, three. That said, we can't. We need to figure out how to kind of uh, sing this verse too. So, we're just going to run this and see what happens. That is... Um That. What was that? That was me. That, that was probably me fucking that up. Uh, uh, there we go. So again, we're just going to sing that again until it feels comfortable. Uh, my, uh, my heart has. There we go. Good to go. What am I doing? Sorry. We're just winging it on silly. the. We're totally winging it on winging it on these vocals. We have okay, no you, idea you, what we're you doing. You do the vocal. I'll do my back and forth. Absolutely. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Has a hole that needs a lid. The heart remembers what the oven did. Shh. Anyway, I'll make it there on a quest for Tupperware. And at that point, you were going to the. Sorry, the... I was doing sound effects. <laughs> it's fine. I'm gonna give you some reverb. I think we need a bit, a bit more mood in the room here. Uh, is this, uh... You should cry through the song. Oh, I'll, I'm, I'm crying on the inside permanently. Uh, there we go. That will get a uh, verb. I, 
obviously I would normally bust this to a verb, but I'm, I'm what, quick here. There we go. Can't see, I'm using the dead duck channels here. Uh, there we go. because we wanted to make music. That is why we are doing it. I'm gonna get a compressor on this so we can just hear it a bit better. And then we've kind of got this like structure here, which is kind of good. So now I can just, uh, we can just swing it. We wrote a song about dental height. Yeah, you had loads of them. You just you just vocal ad living. So oh, yeah, I was doing the monkey vocals. Wasn't it? Uh, so this is like the bridge. Uh, so now, I think at that point the the, the band comes in and the pace increases. Um, this is going to be like this kind of thing. Tap 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 tap. time now, so that's going to be uh, uh, like this. Uh, if I move that backwards, here we go. Uh, Are you using that existing recording then? Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Here we go, so let's just make that a little bit longer so it fits. There we go. There we I go. Were, I thought you were abandoning that. No. No, no, it's still there. Still there. there we go. Because now we've got basically the same chord progression but in the major key now. So. Sleepy. Um, exactly. So now if we, we, we run this. That's absolutely what an oven sounds like. Let me just get uh, get some piano on this. Cause what we need. Uh, and now we've got that, we can kind of undermine it with our 
This is realistically our first two. There's no Tupperware. We're angry. We're upset. We need to get Tupperware and we cannot acquire it for it has been withheld. But for Where what, is the Tupperware? But for what reason has the Tupperware been withheld? For what reason has the Tupperware been with It's a government conspiracy. Uh, that's raising the stakes quite high. Um, Fuck. Yeah. It's a waitress conspiracy. It's a waitress conspiracy I like. Um, if you can afford to get a train and a plane and a bus. Waitress conspiracy. Why, why has waitress done this? Uh, it's the wrong size. Is there no Tupperware or is there no appropriate Tupperware? That's much funnier. That's much funnier. What do you if... Someone needs to hide a body, and then you need Tupperware to put the body in. Yeah. Oh, it's the wrong material. Sure that's no, hold on, hold on, no, no, we've got, we've got problems. We've got, um, one of the problems is they're the wrong size. This one's a circle, and that one's a square. We don't, something Tupperware. Square and Tupperware rhymes. Um, we've got a problem that's the wrong size, but a problem that's the wrong material, and it won't maintain, I mean, I'm thinking about the break, because you... you be storing hair in it. Storing hair. hair I was thinking like hair. the, like if you're trying to dissolve, dissolve a body in acid, like in, um... Breaking Bad. When, just say! Just say! But like, the, when the, like, you've got to get the right container, because otherwise the acid will just eat through it. So, Waitrose Conspiracy. I'm just putting stuff down into the chat right now, into the, the, the notes right now. Um, wrong size. Wrong material. Um, square. Tupperware. Now check out the, uh, the, 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 the structure we had before. So verse one, uh, I caught the bus for a van, played in Birmingham, uh, so we've got this, this one kind of... I don't think rhymes with Waitrose, is it? Waitrose. Uh, conspiracy, conspiracy, there's a Waitrose conspiracy. Aldi? Uh, Aldi, no, it you, 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 you and me, you and me is always one of those like lyrics where you can just like, you can say any, you can just put it into anything, because it means just like, ah, it's you, you, dear listener. Um, so that's, that's an easy lyric to just, just throw in. A uh, waitress conspiracy. Um, uh, the pace has increased here, so how can we... I actually want this to be fast, I want this to be like, uh, here. That's gonna be like there, that's gonna be like there, that's gonna be like, uh, there. This is gonna feel a bit faster. Nice. I can actually just dump a drum kit on this. Um, I'm just gonna do that as like, uh, you know, like the painted black kind of thing. Uh, where, where the, uh, the band comes in on painted black. Uh, so you, dum, 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 dum. Yeah, absolutely, that kind of thing, that kind of thing. So I'm just going to program that in so we got it, because I think that that will help to increase the the, the pace. Oh, um, can't you play it in? Uh, I could play it in, but the thing is, it's going to take ages to like re uh, redo it. Uh, right. Well, in the meantime, I'm, uh, I will return forthwith. Cool, cool, cool. So while that is happening. There we go. I still feel like this could be I faster. A bit of a dance as I walked away. Excellent, so. excellent. It's because you're vibing. It's because we're all vibing. Always. 135. 135. I want this to be even faster. There we go. This should be going hard. That's what we want. This should be like an absolute banger moment. This is where the excitement really kicks in on the track. So, there we go. Uh, we've now got that. Um, uh, let's just get that counting in. Um. Uh, oh, that's going to be really annoying because the time sequence changes there. Um, unless we do this, there we go. That's kind of annoying. That's fine. I'm going to move everything forward one bar. That should be fine. Uh, oh, actually, I can just do a bar of two, four here. That will make it so that it flows a bit more nicely. Because I just want this to be like uh, a bit of a kind of entry here. There we go. Uh, let's get that to move. There we go. Uh, uh, can I make this work? There we go. That's what I really want. Uh, so now we've got that hopefully flowing fairly smoothly. Um, we can get into this very, very upbeat and exciting next section. Uh, bam. There is where we're coming in. And now we are on the go. Let's get that looping. Is that looping? Yes. So I think the verse is coming here. Um, we need to 
get the uh, kind of uh, vibe there. So I'm just gonna start singing and see if we can get it. Waitress Conspiracy, the wrong size, wrong material, square top away. Um, uh, after this, we get to the chorus. That's gonna be about here. But I think we, we still got that kind of, um, that verse chorusing, because this is just that chord loop. Uh, I can make this a little bit more accurate. Uh, there we go. Get everything snapped to the grid. There we go. I want everything on the grid all the time. I realize my face, is, as, as it so often is, my face is in the way. So I'm going to move my face over. Let's get my face up here. That's probably all right. There we go. That vignette is annoying, so I'm going to remove that. There we go. So now... There we go, we can kind of see where those timing kind of uh, uh, errors are, so we can just move that. Just feel a little bit smoother when that should, go. that should go there. That looks okay. This looks okay. Oh, that's off the grid. I thought that was looking weird. So why is that? Oh, it's not locked in. There we go. Uh, let's just move that there. Group it. Quantize it. Done. Bam. So now that should loop perfectly without any issues because if your MIDI isn't looping perfectly, then nothing will work. This is just going to become a nightmare. So. Oh, that's ugly. We got it. So, while I am trying to figure this one out, what I'm going to do is quickly grab the chat so I can see what's going on because I accidentally closed the window earlier because I need more monitors. I'm doing musical magic. It's all musical magic. Um, we were talking about this earlier. The goal is to have like a system for developing stuff so we can just like make a good song every single time. We never want to be in a position where we start writing and we just can't come up with something good. I've just realized that the camera is currently set so you can actually see that the desk is super messy, but that's fine. We always want to be able to write cool stuff every single time, whether that's happening with, hey, whether that's happening with music or whether that's happening with comedy. So this system seems to be working. I think, I think we're happy with it. So. is a verse here. We need to think about uh, what we're singing. We've got our lyrics over here. Waitress Conspiracy, the wrong size, the wrong material. Uh, I think this is too much, too much. I think I want that there. I think I want that there. Uh, I'll get that uh, there and there. What's new? What's new? What's new in, uh, is the system being cool and good and stuff? Yes, that is one of it. But the thing is, if you know how to copy the stuff, then you can do that. Oh, I've realized that you didn't do the thing. There we go. Um, so um, the, the system is basically having a decent understanding of music theory, which you can learn from a book, and a decent understanding of the way comedy works, which we have got this list to submit. Who, what, and where, why? I don't know if I do have a decent understanding of music theory, I just do it. And... This is, that's good enough. Music theory is just language. But the, 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 the goal is that you, like, knowing the rules can kind of, you're kicking me under the table, that's not nice. Um, uh, and it go. Um, here, oh, we've got the, the opportunity to add a snare drum in here. So it does take, maybe take a little bit more practice than I'm letting on, but there we go. Let's just, uh... But that works, that's identical to Cubase. Oh yeah, yeah, it's the same. Lovely. So, we've now got this kind of verse section. So we've kind of got to uh, get the, establish the waitress conspiracy. Um, there's nothing here, uh, waitress conspiracy. Um, the previous line was, I caught the bus, I caught the tram. There's nothing here, uh, there's nothing there, there's nothing here. The shelves are, there's nothing there, the shelves are bare. I like that. Uh, there's nothing there. The shelves are bare. There's nothing there, the shelves are bare. Uh, this waitress conspiracy. Conspiracy is a difficult word to rhyme, you're right. Um, instead what we need is, what's another word for a conspiracy? A gate? A gate. Waitress I, gate. I, I, I always think that's... Good? Bad? It's bad, isn't it? Bad, yeah. You're taking a word and you're no, There's nothing the there, on. the shelves are bare. Waitress conspiracy. Again, conspiracy. Standing in my underwear. Standing in my underwear. <laughs> Uh, that just sounds like like describing a weird dream or something like that. Uh, I'm just gonna reopen the chat because I keep closing it's it. There a we fugue go. State. A fugue state. A fugue state. That doesn't uh, rhyme there, I think. Uh, plot and scheme. Plot and scheme. Uh, waitress. Plot and scheme. That's good. Waitress. 
The Waitrose Tupperware scheme has failed. There you have it. It's not that it's a conspiracy. It's just more like a like a like a scandal, or it's yeah. like a scandal or something like that. Um, uh, Waitrose. The Tupperware. Tupperware is too much. The Waitrose. Um, it doesn't have to be a Waitrose, you know. It could be Aldi. Yeah. Uh, the uh, the Aldi food prep scheme has failed. The Aldi food, uh, there's nothing there, there's nothing, Charles the Bear, it feels like it wants to rhyme with bear. Yeah, um, I, I agree, I don't think that bear, one's working at all. The shelves are bare. Um, Maybe it shouldn't bear. be a conspiracy, because it's it's proving difficult, I think. Because Possibly. Uh, um, uh, my, my food, my proof, uh, my food prep scheme has failed. My, there we go, that, my food prep scheme isn't there. It's, there, we need words of the rhyme there. Bear, scare, uh, despair is in despair. The food of fear leaves me, leaves me in despair. Leaves me. Um, food prep misstep. Uh, food prep step. Um, um, he's food prep. Missteps, uh, missteps in circles and squares. All the wrong, all the wrong size of tuple. See, Where? I almost definitely would have gone for the second line as I'm standing in my underwear. It's such a weird visual image. It, it does. It, it is a, an image. I think that is good because we don't have that. Um, I, I just wish there was a way to make it more relevant. So it feels like we're, it's kind of all, like creating a new tangent. But it's like, uh, I would I'll maybe go through like... Can we, can we use it as a metaphor rather than... Uh, uh, like you're, you're in the aisle. Food prep misstep I like. Uh, in the aisle... You're in the aisle holding... Well, you're not holding anything, are you? Your, your basket's empty. Uh, so we've got... I don't know, I'm not, I'm not adding loads there. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not feeling like we've, we've got this first nail down, but let's see if we can just put something there so it's there and we can, we can rework. There's nothing there! Uh, what, what, what do we want? This is an A to a G to an E. Nothing, nothing there! There's nothing there! There's nothing there! The shelves are bare! A food prep scheme leaves me in despair! This isn't recording. Uh, let's do that and that. Uh, I'm just, again, just, just trying to get something down so we can, we can paste it. There's nothing there! The shelves are bare! Spare. Food prep steps in circles and squares. All the wrong size of Tupperware. Something like that. Um, that does kind of work as a drop, maybe. Uh, let's just do that. All the wrong size of Tupperware. Digga, 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 digga. There we go. We love it. We love it. Uh, where's my digga, digga? Digger. No, hold on, I've got a macro for this. Digger, 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 digger. Digger, digger. There we go. Uh, that feels like it could be. All the wrong size of top. That should go there. All the wrong size of top. Oh, I need to get rid of that. There we go. Is that what you're top doing? Top uh, where does that? I'm just pulling stuff into time. I want that to land on the beat. There we go. That can go on the beat as well. And then we come back in for the other half of the verse. That copied too many things. Why are you doing this? Don't do that. There we go. There. We copy the same part over. Um, I think we need a chord. I think you should show the audience this. Oh no, oh no! There we go. It's so annoying having to like copy stuff over. I like that chord. I'm gonna put that in there and see if that, how that works. There we go. Yay! There we go. Um. Yeah, yeah, no, I hit control to S constantly. Underwear life. What is that? <laughs> Underwear life. Oh no, my Google search history has come up. 
Metaphorically unprepared. Yeah, I was thinking that. I was thinking that. Drop on where. Make the chat mm. look like you, Diane's search history. <laughs> Don't make it look like my search history. Oh, do do oh, do do that. Yeah, whatever. Like at this point, it's better than what people keep doing, especially with uh, uh, Eeyore, Mischief Tell, and Anna. Uh, they have caused enough trouble. Enough trouble. It's time for a different kind of trouble. Um, I think this could be a, 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 a chorus, maybe. Maybe just go straight to the chorus. Um, there we go. That's just gonna be that. Um, this is shifted up uh, to um, B, G, A, and F sharp. There we go. Um, and this is our um, where to go, never enough. I think that um, I like the idea of it going up. I like the idea of it going up, but what if we shift to the minor key? Well, not all majors, because that's uh, uh, F sharp minor, circle of fifths. There we go. Here we go. If we're over here, I think we're over here. A, F sharp minor, we can do that. Uh, that was uh, a B. We've got a B chord nearby. We don't. That will lead us back to the E. Explain uh, the circle of fifths. So, because these chords are related to each other around the edge of the circle of fifths, the closer they are, like clockwise, from C to G is close, C to A minor is very, very close, uh, major chords on the outside, minor chords on the inside. Is that always a 90 degree angle then? Uh, well, if you're on, for example, the chord D, then you can go to this place, this place, this place, this place, or this place, and they will all sound really nice. So, we've currently so got... you can go from like a D to a B flat? You can do, but it's going to sound weird. I've heard it before. It will just sound. It won't sound bad, but it will sound spicier. I'm pretty sure that's my Burning Bridges song. Uh, possibly. Yeah. Uh, so what I want to know is, can we, if we just do B minor A F sharp minor, what can we do that? B minor uh, A F sharp minor. Yeah, it's pretty much. Yeah, you can go for the F sharp major as well. That also works. Do the F sharp major. Well, major. We had this debate before, didn't we? When Just it was A G. Mm. Go for the. Go for that. It's a bit too obvious, isn't it? Um, can we do something like? I don't think we can go into groups of three. That dispose of the body into what? I think it will say. That's going to be our, our verse. Our, our, our... Oh no, there we go, there we go, that's it. The disposal of the body, that's the middle eight twist. Oh, I forgot we'd killed someone. We've killed, well, how can you forget? The body's like right there. It's just off camera. It's like under the desk and that's why we're doing this. This is all a ploy to like, try and get, get away with this. So, um, we're remembering that the, the reason that we're trying to do this is because we've just killed and dismembered somebody. That's the twist of the song. So, uh, we're dealing with chorus here. Um, chorus. Does this, does this chord work or have I gone insane? I like the idea of going up to the B. Uh, if I do that, ah, G, E minor, B minor, D. Um, if I do this with the B, like I have a think over here, that was G, E minor, B minor, D. Let's look at that shape. G, E minor, B minor, D. So that's kind of like a clockwise, uh, a clockwise kind of angly thing. If I start on a B and do the clockwise angly thing, uh, I'll go there, there, and there. That means if I transpose that by copying the shape over and just moving it around the cycle of fifths, B, G sharp minor, E flat minor, F sharp major. That would be B, G sharp minor, G sharp minor, uh, D sharp minor, F sharp major. Can you have a go at playing those chords? Just bear with me. I've got there are plans and schemes happening here. I think that's uh, um, uh, Just those ones. yeah. B G sharp minor D sharp minor. I think it's going to be. Uh, What's got, drumming pattern? Then? I've got the piano. Uh, just the same as same as before. I think. Um, That'll be uh, B, G sharp, D minor, sharp minor? I know G sharp, minor. F sharp. I'm going to be fourth fret, minor on the fourth fret. 
Because uh, the idea is if it's the same as this original chord progression, then we can get that same vibe. B to G sharp minor to D minor to F. Oh no, no, pardon me, to F. Okay. F, sharp. F. B to G sharp minor to D sharp minor. is going to give us the chord we want, starting at the right time. Move everything onto the beat. That should go there. I think that's right. You're going to hear my three... There we go. Just pop it again. Fine. There we go. Cool. So now... Can we get a B, uh, a B, oh, no, 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 B minor, A, G, a B minor, A, G. one as well, just to make sure it works. Pull that there, pull that back, pull that back, back, there we go. So like, we've kind of got two options here. Maybe we could alternate between them, I'm not sure, but uh, this kind of, um, feels too long. I'm thinking like an outro kind of thing. Let's try this. Um, can you give me an F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F, F, F. In fact, can you make it the spicy F? That's gonna be something like, uh, whatever that, that F sharp we played before was. Perfect. Why 
is in your head? Because you, you, you are like going full sort of steam ahead. So I'm thinking about the F we had before, and I'm thinking we need to get back to that S. Sometimes I think about that's the like, F. That's like the, the anchor we've got. It's <laughs> like the anchor we've got, so we've got to kind of like... To be honest, I think this is like an outro uh, for the whole song, and what we need here is this. So I'm kind of thinking of the entire song. So this is going to happen once. There we go. So this is like the uh, the, the main one. Uh, this is chorus end, and then we're gonna have a middle eight. Um, we have a middle seven point four. Um, go. Shit them up, wouldn't it? <laughs> so there's that. Uh, we need a middle eight. Uh, middle eight. That's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, we can add some more time. That's going to be um, chorus. We do the same thing. We copy and paste it over. But this time, we get the whole outro instead. Uh, and I've got to find that because I put it somewhere. There we go. Um, here we go. That is there. Uh, that is going to go there. Pull that back in, make sure it's in time. In time. In time. If you don't pull it in time, the idea sounds like it doesn't work. When actually it does, it just needs to be presented correctly. There we go. So now, we've got the end of the song in sight now. We just need to get the chorus. We've got this hook. There's never enough where did it go. Uh, never enough where did it go. Um, that could be a chant. Never never enough, where did it go? Never enough, where did it go? Never enough, where did it go? Never enough, never, where did it go? Never enough, where did it go? Never enough, where did it go? Never enough, where did it go? It's not rhythmic. I like that movie here. Never enough, where did it go? 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 But, something like that. I think that's the chorus end. You just like pull that out of thin air, really, that chorus. Uh, well, no, 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 that was the, the chord progression we did before. It was the uh, the same thing we did before. Yeah. That was G, E minor, B, D, but I capoed it in my head to be G sharp. Because I wanted your head it. capo. Exactly. Use your head capo. So, like, your head capo to that thing, because I, I before... I normally use a cap on my head, not a head Because be before we had was this. <laughs> And there, we were about to go back to the same chord, and I didn't want that. I thought that if we go up a key, we just literally just take the whole key and just go... Can we hear it right through so far? We can do. I just wanted to kind of feel like it's gone somewhere higher for the chorus. So now I've got this. In fact, are you good to buy me some time while I go to the loo? Yes! You are going to entertain the crowd, the chat is here, you're going to listen to it, and you're going to tell everyone what you think needs to be done to make this workable. Including anything that you don't like that needs to be redrafted. We need to whack a bass guitar on. Well, I think we've got to get to the end of the song first, we can, we, we can deal with that later. But like, we need to write the middle eight and some chorus lyrics and then we're done. I'm but going to be Diane, right? You, yeah, you're going to be Diane and I'm going to be, I'm going to be Sasha. Sasha. Yeah. So, uh, if you get, if you get writing or speaking, I will get weeing.
see, I, I feel like listening to this, it's it's like come out of nowhere. Um, the way Diane and I write is completely different. That it's it's not even comparable. The way it's sort of being built up with little bits of recordings is so unlike me. So I'm like, God, this song has just sort of appeared. And so, we're back. Yeah, I, I was just saying, I would I would more likely be be like getting a notepad, a guitar, and just vamping it till it seems right. But your structured approach is. It's really. I'm really impressed. It, I it, could never do it though. It's not like uh, you absolutely could uh, because you are very, very clever. But Worms 3D title music. That's a throwback. I've not played Worms 3D in a long, long ass time. I had a breath. I, did, I, did, I, did, I, did, I, I ran up the stairs there. and I'm out of breath now. You don't um, think I could handle it? No, I absolutely think you could. I absolutely. No, think I, you could. I just don't think I have the discipline to. It's not that I'm like not clever. I just don't have the discipline you, to click use on the, it. Click on the circle fits. In the bottom left. Right here? Yes. Uh, the other one, other one. Circle fits. Love it. Yes. Sorry, I can't so, like, see. Normally I'm thinking like this. I'm thinking like, oh, if I'm at this corner, I want to get to this corner to do something different. Oh, I'd, 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 I'd hate using the circle fits. <laughs> because it's like, god damn, just, I've it, got to follow guides. It, it just tells me all the chords I can use. It's, it's only like a, like a guide rather than... Like see, a, I like stumbling accidentally into things. Yeah. That's, fair. that's what that's what my hero songwriters did, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, so I... I uh, this, the problem is I have no imagination at all. I can't hear any music in my head. It, there's nothing in there. It's completely well, that, empty. Yeah, because you've yeah you've said this before, mm. haven't you? It's that gives you a unique well, way of approaching in maybe. some way. It just means that like I, I end you, up with. But you're so passionate about the music as well. It gives me it gives me like a technical technical focus rather than. Uh, I don't know anything else, but like it's just the so a discipline, you know, the maths because there's maths, isn't there, and uh, things like fifths and uh, it's, it's more like kind of it's not quite maths as much as it is just trying to I don't know I'm, I'm always trying to like think about like structuring the whole thing in the outset. So like you were saying, oh, what are you thinking about? I'm thinking, okay, well this is the chorus. How am I going to get to the outro? Okay, this works the outro. How am I going to get to the middle eight? So speaking of, we need to jump in. Did you have any thoughts on your listen through? I noticed that Pike said it's a banger. Is that Reaper? Is that true? Yeah, that's the one, that's the one. Lovely. No, we, we, you, were, you were just fast. Cool, cool, cool. So, so I, I listened through and you came in pretty much. I'm going to jump in. Just I was, I was just saying that there's like an orphaned piano bit. Uh, yeah, I think I could get piano on the rest of it. Oops, big swap, big swap. No, I think the piano might be uh, I, a bit much, actually. You reckon? Because I was going to just dumping like... Uh, I, I don't know whether it's just a bit the way that you use the guitar is quite bass heavy. Like, then we can plan it out. Middle eight's gonna have to be like slower to get some get some contrast here. Um, right, time we got. I keep saying to you, we need contrast. No, yes, contrast. no such thing. Um, um, let me have a think. Uh, let's get tip away. There, cool. Let's just get that. Uh, do that. I do that. That's the wrong. S ah, that's fine to be honest. Let's get that in there. Uh, Do you like dental go. hygiene? I love brushing my teeth. Sorry, brushing my teeth only. Uh, Probably just go. Pick us the guitar. That works. Um, just gonna glue that, copy and paste it. Gonna move all of these crashes except one back up. There we go. I suspect this will need another repeat. So now I think, um, can we do something finger picky here? Maybe to re reprise the, the, the middle, the, the beginning. The beginning was that A sus, A sus, G E minor. Um, if you just think. <laughs> Pick everything, just keep, keep it super low. I like that. Uh, yeah, go for it. That's it. Dum da 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 da
if you finger pick that and move up to a spicy G. Like that? Yes. Yeah. You might have to wind me back Yeah, I'll wind yeah. back in. You got a little bit of delay on Reaper. Uh, yeah, it's not that comfortable, is it? Uh, it's, it's because I've got this really dodgy audio interface for streaming. Um, I know, I mean, you're only ever talking nonsense, but I'm here for it. That's the kind of nonsense that I like. So, over here. Um, okay. Nice. Here yeah, you even just leave that G ringing out. Or can you like... Nice, excellent. There, so we got it, we got it. That I think is the end of that section. Uh, so now we can pull a, a, a loop out of this. That was there. Uh, there we go. Well, uh, that, yeah, yeah, uh, that's resolved by doing this. Ooh. So I'm just making that bigger so I can see it, and I'm going to pull it all in time. I was wondering for a while if I was just playing it really weird. No, 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 uh, I've got a dodgy, dodgy audio interface. Here we go. That's over here. That's gonna get moved. Um, pull it back to the beginning. I think you should bangle it. There. We come back in. Um, get that back in time. Again, your timing is really good. It's just that. First of all, a bit delay, and we're totally winging it. No retakes. There, we need the same thing. Uh, there, chorus goes here. Uh, can you give us uh, um, uh, da, 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 uh, up to an A? Just uh, if you play like a, a, an A bar chord on the fifth fret of the low E string. You play the, like the, yeah. Lovely. Just finger pick that real quick. Trust me on it. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, can you do an A to a B? Just, just take that and just do it even further up. So, dun, 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 dun. Perfect. I'm barring that really damn hard. We I do that better actually. We love the horrible bar chords. We love them. Here we go. Oh. Oh, do you know when I record, it's like I've got to do this track through the full three minutes all in one go. Oh, what well, we whole thing. Yeah, I mean that's what I would do after this, like just to try and get it, get it. But I would know, never even demo like this. It's great. It's a great way of doing it. Hmm. So here, I'm gonna just take this and I'm gonna turn it into like a full drum beat. Uh, that's all gonna go on here. Let's just crash every single. Give me an open piano note on that one.
see who did more. That was okay. working, wasn't it? Uh, for this one. Yeah. Uh, Change, but that works. It's like a thing. I like the claps uh, as well. Um, oh, I got the wrong way. Um, yeah. What do you think? This is at home? When Bangladon switches to Bangla drum, it gets a chuckle. I knew it would. I knew someone would appreciate it. What do you think about this kind of like piano thing? Is this is the button? So this is the kind of like uh, um, I don't know what this is. I just whack it down like the enemy. Yeah, it definitely needs to come down. Uh, I just want to get this fixed because it currently sounds. Give it some ooze as well. Uh, quantize, eighty percent quantize. That there we go. Quantize. To get quantized as well. Hit everything. Quantize at 80%. Quantize the hell out of that. That works. I want this to be uh, up a third. There we go. There we go. So really all we need is our chorus hook, which we don't currently have. Now normally we try and stop this at about 8 o'clock. So really, we're running up the clock. We can go further, but we're, we're running up the clock. No one has to write a song in two hours. No, the goal is to get a finished song. That's the mission. So we've got to get a I chorus hook. I speak super finish. Quick. Sorry? Oh, we're... Uh, very good, very good. So, we need to get like a, a chorus hook here. Um... The, the goal is... Oh, no, no, hold on, we didn't have a middle eight, either. Uh, um, I caught the bus, I caught the tram. We're relying on these same same lyrics. Uh, give, give me the give me the instrumental, and... Uh... I think, I think, uh, if we, um... There's a, uh, there's a body here. Um... In pieces... Say that for freshness. In pieces... Uh... Uh, uh, pieces we tear, pieces we tear. Fucking hell. Okay, well, the thing is, we've got to, we've got to, we've got to like shock people with like, oh, so it's a dead body. With, uh, um, when you hide a body, um, you need a plan. You need a plan. Um, you kill uh, some things. You, uh, you something you kill. You kill the the man. Plan man a man a plan a canal. You put the man Panama. first, and then you put the second line in yeah. as plan. Cool. Um, yeah. So you hide a body. You need a plan. Um, uh, something we kill. Uh, you kill the man. Um, I must admit, I killed a man. Hold on, no, 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 you... This isn't that funny, is it? It's just sort of no, murderous. No, no, absolutely, but I think it's, yeah, trying to get, like, the connecting it to everything else is, like, so hopefully in the context of the song it will work. But again, we can... You wrote I Am Silly. What a shock. I would never have thunk it. Um, um... I was, I was doing it using your voice. You're silly. I'll die. Uh, steal 
You steal the pasta. You, you steal kill the, the pasta? Man. Well, this is the meal. You steal the leftovers. You kill the man. When you hide a body, you need a plan. Um, uh, the Tupperware. Where did the pasta come in? I've so, got... the Tupperware. That's what we're doing. Are we not doing this for Tupperware? Is this not the origin story? I don't know. This is this is me winging it. Winging it. Winging it. So we've got some kind of like origin story here. We we are getting the Tupperware to dispose of a body. Um, so the only sensible option is to store the body in the same kind of Tupperware from the pasta which we stole. Pasta isn't funny. We can get a funnier food. What's the funniest food you can put in a uh, thingy? In a thingy. The funniest food. The funniest leftover food. Hmm. The funniest leftover food. Uh, you steal leftover. You steal leftover. Leftover pavlova. When you hunt. You kill. Um, uh, something. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Um, you see a left over five you kill the man, you hide the body, you need a plan. Um, I, uh, I took the lunch. You took, took the I lunch. I took, I took his lunch. His lunch. I took, took, his, took his lunch. I took his lunch. Yeah, um, okay. Something, uh. Wait, you're killing someone for their food? And yeah, and I put him. So we're not putting I, the person in a temple. In his Tupperware. You put him in his Tupperware. Um, well, you already put him in his place. His own. I put him in his own Tupperware. His lunch has been on the toast. See, so you won't. You can't. No one has leftover beans on. No toast. one has leftover beans so on toast. So good. A full English is funny, but it, again, it's like it's just not what you do, is it? Pavlova. I don't. I don't think that's that's much better. But uh, I think you, it's. You steal his lunch. You kill the man. That's. You steal his lunch, you kill the man. That, that works, it's got the right amount yeah, of I, I stole his lunch. I killed the man. I, you... I killed uh, the man. I stole his lunch, that's past tense. I, I killed the man. I, I, I stole his I, lunch, I killed the man. When you hide one, you need a plan. Um, what rhymes with Tupperware? We're back to Tupperware. Uh, for yes, English man. That's a snare. Played the snare. Anna, you missed the song. Yeah, yeah, you've you've kind of yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Um, I'm really liking what Pike said again. A full English, it's a full English, but a full English man. Just picture him Britain first now. That's why are you always. What what is it with you and Britain first? Oh, I. That just makes I you sound really face to face with them. So grim, grim, absolute grimness. Um, I took his lunch. I need a plan. I saw a lunch, I killed the man. You hide a body, you need a plan. Uh, frying I... pan. Yeah. Everyone loves um, a frying pan. Yeah. Uh, uh, from... I like how Anna's just obviously logged on and she can from, see. From fr- I saw his lunch, I killed the man when you hide from a From frying body. pan to. What are you doing? Like. To beneath. Venetian. To beneath the stair, I put him in his own Tupperware. Uh, let's find out how this goes. He's not gonna. I stole his lunch. I stole his lunch. I stole his lunch. I killed the man. When you hide a body, you need a plan. From frying pan to beneath the stairs, I put him in his own Tupperware. But that is paying off, isn't it? Yeah, it yeah. works. It works. It works. Um, you're right. Instrumental. We're gonna get guitar solo on this. I stole his lunch, I killed it's not recording. Uh that was it should have been a guitar part. There we go. Uh that's gonna go uh here we go. Uh my here, sorry. Uh you're welcome, uh, yeah, yeah, Adlib on it, on it. Uh but we're gonna we're gonna go into a guitar solo after the Tupperware. Well, no, then yeah, I'll wait. Here we go. I stole his lunch, I killed a man. When you hide a body, you need a plan. From frying pan to beneath the stairs, I put him in his own Tupperware. Can you 
come in on that with like a, uh, uh, um, like, in the middle of the solo? Uh, sorry, sorry, on the, uh, like, underneath what I'm doing. Uh, there, there, so like, it's gonna be like halfway through. And there. Uh, let's get rid of that, here we go. Take over from you. I'm gonna. There we go. That's where the uh, the section changes. Um. So I'm going to shift this up and see what happens. Hold on. Uh, uh, can you give me whatever that note is? Is that a B? Might be, yeah, that note. Just, just, just ring that note. There we go. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. There we go. Some piano. Uh, something like that. I'm trying to get that to kind of come out right without it coming weird. Um, I'm just going to duplicate the piano just to get it out of the way. There we go. Piano two. Cool. There we go. Uh, that's like close enough as like a thing. There we go. I'm just gonna tweak that until it works. So let's just pull that back to the beginning. So I everything can quantize it. Lovely. There we go. That guitar part is too quiet, so let's just turn that up. There we go. Uh, try that. There we go. That's uh, like a whole thing. We just need a chorus and an outro. Uh, chorus, chorus, chorus. What have we got? Something like. I can't remember the Yang. It was never enough. Where did it go? Um. I'm in this place and I'm all alone. Uh, it's in this place without a lid. I don't know, is that something we can use? Something without a lid? Go in alone at half rhymes, which is fine. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so, uh... Recapo? Recapo. Where, uh, where, where? Go in alone at half rhymes, which is why I... Uh, give me, sorry, give me the whole lyric. Without a lid, I'm all alone. Where did it go? Without a lid, I'm all alone. 
Where did it go? Uh, what was the follow up line there? Uh, Cool, sorry, I need to hit enable. Nice, let's just take that again, and I'll unbreak it. Here we go. I, I love the strings. Where did it go? Without a lid, I'm all alone. Where did it go? Nice, nice, that works, that works. So, I think we need a second line, where did it go? Um, Tupperware, uh, we need to emphasize that this is Tupperware. I'm a shit creek for... Tupperware, tup, um, without, without it I'm all alone. Where did it go? Tupperware, what rhymes with alone? Phone, bone, cone, loan, alone, we've already done alone. Alone. Tupperware on loan. On loan, Tupperware on loan, gone. Phone, bone, cone, don, ing, phone, gone, hone, hone. I'm literally just going through the alphabet. H, I, joan, cone, loan, moan, known, known. There we go. Tupper. Uh, the Tupperware's location isn't known. Tupperware's location isn't known. Cool. Tupperware's location isn't known. That line feels like it's gotta got like carry on. I don't know how, where did it go? Uh, Tupperware's location isn't known. Something like that, something that works. We're kind of running out of steam here with this Tupperware, one. Tupperware, blah, 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 blown. Uh, Tupperware's cover, Agent Tupperware's cover is blown. <laughs> what even is that? Uh, Tupperware cover lid, cover lid. Yeah. Uh, Tupperware's cover, Tupperware's cover isn't known. Uh, condone? Uh, the, the murder hasn't been revealed yet. To, uh, can we allude to murder? Uh, the top. I need. Uh, where did it go? Um, without. Uh, without. Without the box, my. My cover is blown. I don't know. Without the box, without a box, this cover is blown. The cover is blown? That works. It's, it's a non sequitur, but it can get redrafted. Without a cover, this cover, without a box, this cover is blown. Same. I think we had uh, a loan before. Uh, own. 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 Um, yeah. It's on its own. It's on its own. It's on its own. It's on its own. That vocal is out of key. It's cheap, Alex. I'm just gonna get some sneaky auto tune on this just to get this to stay in key. Uh, there we go. Yay! We're doing a song about Tupperware. Uh, Something like, um, what do we need? What do we need? Um, without a box, my cover is blown. Um, uh, cut top wire is on its own. It's on its own. What chords were those? What do we do? Um, B, A, no, that wasn't it. It was. Yeah, B minor. It was B minor. Uh, let's just get that on the piano. That was. There we go, that's 
it's gonna be, uh, it, it's on, it's on. Uh, oh, that's a B major. It's on, 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 it's on. That's gonna be slightly weird, but let's see what happens there. Um, uh, can I move that? There we go. Uh, for it now. Yeah? Yep. Excellent. We like dots. Okay. That needs to get cut off. We can now copy and paste this over. In theory, we are fast approaching a full song. Let's find out. Dumps at the chorus. Uh, here we go. Never enough. Okay, we've got that as a thing. We've also got this. As Just rather than it's on its own, we need one outro lyric like it's on its own. I'm home alone. Uh, home alone. I'm Macaulay Culkin in Home Alone. Watching Home Alone. I'm watching Home Alone, and that's why we did the murder. We need one more thing. One more thing, and then we can knock this silly song on the head. Um, never enough where to go. Um, the goal is to try and explain who, what, when, or why. Uh, why did we steal his lunch? Hungry. You we are hungry. Um, <laughs> I was hungry, I needed da, 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 da. I was hungry. I needed lunch. I was hungry. I needed, I needed lunch. lunch. Um, on his corpse, I thought I'd munch. On his corpse, I thought I'd munch. You know, I, I tried to write a funny song about a murder I, like 13 years ago, and everyone just told me I was sick. For, uh... Had to store the rest. Store the rest. No box to place it best. Stuff no. What? I, no, we we need to store the rest of this in Tupperware. We need to store the corpse in Tupperware. Full, I had to store the rest. So we need to put put him in. We need to put the the person in Tupperware. Yeah, yeah. I had to store the rest. Fresh isn't a word. In, in, tupper, in Tupperware, uh, he he will stay. Fresh. In Tupperware, he will stay fresh. So that's gonna be. Let's put the back. Oh no, you're on the wrong screen. It really summarizes the end. That was the goal. That was the goal. I want to uh, summarize. So that's gonna be. I was hungry. I needed lunch. You can sing this. But cool, cool, cool. I was hungry. I needed lunch. 
On his corpse, I thought I'd munch. I was getting full, had to store the rest oh. in Tupperware. He will stay fresh. Nice. There's a shuttlecock up there. Hmm? There's a shuttlecock up there. What? I'm being I'm being bored in Lynn. Enjoy. Oh, excellent. Oh. I didn't just call you Lynn, but it's deliberate. Where's that uh thing? Let me just look in there. There we go. That works. Uh, obviously, a lot of this is, is, is somewhat weak thrown together, but what's great here is that this is now a full song, so we can listen to this from start to finish and make a final judgment on it. So, are we ready to listen to this whole thing? With the dance routine. Yeah. With the dance routine. Excellent. If you want to get the dance routine ready, shall I uh, full screen cam this or shall we... Um, uh, yeah, why not, why not, why not. Cool. So, we're now going to play the thing. You're back and we'll see how it goes. Uh, do, we don't need that. There we go. Cool. So... Uh, Have uh, I been off screen for the last 10 minutes? No, no, you're just in the corner. So, I'm going to do the thing in Reaper. Let's get the dance routine here. Sugar crashing so There's hard. There's only so much I can do sitting down. I had to get up. <laughs> so, um, 
we now have to do a review it. Um, what's good about this? What didn't work? Did the, did the system work? Did what? what no, we should have just vamped it. True, vamp. You reckon? What? Just, just no, that's how I would have written it, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. We're different writers. We write differently. So operation's difficult. Absolutely, absolutely. So I think I think that this like kind of works. I think there's like there's jokes that miss, but I think that that's fine because I think that there's there's enough here that. In theory, if we sat down and did like another session on it, which like isn't on the cards, but like, you, you, well, you, you can tell people it's not a comedy song. If you, it's if a serious, you, it's a very serious song about the dangers of killing someone and trying to find and locate Tupperware. I don't think that we we were kind of maintained the uh, the creative vision. I suspect with like we we're talking about Tenacious D earlier, if. Uh, I suspect they would have an idea like this, and then there was something right. Well, that joke doesn't actually add up to that joke. We've not set this up and paid it off, right? So I think there's like threads here that work, but then we'd have to like make them smoother and, and kind of make them. And I think I should do more with the legs. More with the legs. Yeah, absolutely. I think that. <laughs> I think that like. Like, it kind of works as a, as a draft, and then we would have to kind of rework it. But the whole song kind of feels quite exciting on its own. We were saying, does it, in order to make a good comedy song, do you need a, um, the, the comedy needs to be funny, but the music also needs to be good. You, um, you really made the music good, though. In a way, I think, I well, know. well let's, let's leave it for chat to say, did the music work, or did the, did the music fall flat there? I know that it approximately works. I think that it could be better, but I think that it approximately works. Um, the <sighs> second question is, did the comedy work? And um, what are you, you're narrowing your eyes here, you're thinking... No, I'm just trying to look at oh, my yeah. um, the, the comedy, I think that the, the ideas are there. There are jokes isolated on their own. Oh, I can read that now. <laughs> Monumental, yes. So uh, I can't see that normally. You've got contact lenses where you've got a button that has like a zoom in button. Yeah, I tell you what, when I like, even though the contacts are designed to fit most, when I go like that, I can see clearer. It's like it's bend it, weird. bend it to it, so it's like a fine line. Clearly, they, clearly they've got potential to be able to allow me to see properly. I have to <laughs> be nudging my eye so I can. But yeah, so so the the joke, there are, there are jokes in here that work, but but they don't fit into a larger funny structure. They're just individual jokes. Very funny, very well, funny, I'm, very I'm funny. My eyes <laughs> <don't see. laughs> but the, the, they don't fit into a larger structure. So I think what it needs Sam, is, Sam said do a flip. Well, there you go. So um, in order to try and get it to be like a, a kind of a like a, a funniest to make the comedy work better. We need to redraft to try and make all the jokes line up because at the minute they just work on their own. There's a dead guy here. There's Birmingham over here. We've got several modes of transport. We're eating him. Like, it's I, th I think I would have looked more into the aspects of Tupperware, the click yeah. of the lid. Yeah, the, the, the sensory model. experience of using it. But that's I would have gone. I would have overstated how much I loved Tupperware. But that's my thing, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. But but I think I think in terms of like a way of developing this further, that that's how we'd do it. We'd kind of probably rewrite the lyrics because I think the melodies are good. I think the melodies are fine. Melodies are bloody amazing. So so we kind of re develop it, and probably rework the lyrics to be even more to the point and that kind of thing. But we clicky Tupperware. We like it. We like it. So we I think we'll leave it. There. Does anyone have any particular requests before we go? I have one request. Everyone who is in this chat should follow my Twitch thing because I need lots and lots of followers to make the numbers go up, which would be stonks. What? That just sounds really, uh, that was, that's such a lovely, lovely chord, lovely chord. It would be stonks to get the numbers to go up. So if you haven't followed me, please follow me. But, the other thing is, um, tup how can Tupperware is like a timeless classic? Tupperware is like bricks or or the wheel, like bricks. It can't, it's not going to go out of fashion. Bricks, Surely right? it remains. It bricks can, won't go out of fashion. Like improve bricks. How could you improve a brick? It's a square with a that's longer. It's a long square. You can't improve upon bricks. I think we should do a song about bricks. Well, we can do that next time, but. Um, the other thing that I, I would I would request is that everyone go and listen to Bricks. Mulk. <laughs> <laughs> everyone go and listen to Mulk because Mulk is very good. They're long rect no a rectangle is just a long rectangles. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect rectangles. <laughs> Thank you, st Sphere Bricks. That's it. Oh. So, 
Prince, 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 Prince. Thank you so much. We will leave it there, and Sasha is going to sing us out by continuing the song with Bricks. Thank you so much. I will see you then. Bye. Oh no, it didn't load. Oh no, it didn't load, so you got to do this. There we go, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, Bricks. Bricks. Oh yeah, yeah, we're still going. We're still going. We're still going, but we're trying to make them leave. That's the plan. We've got to make got them it, leave. <laughs> leave. Go. Go. The movie. Leave. Why are you still here? The movie leave. is over. Go. Shh. We could. We could. We had originally planned on leaving with a freeze frame. Shall we? Shall we freeze frame? Yeah. Let's go back. Let's go back. Okay. Freeze frame. Thanks so much for watching. Bye! <laughs> you have to stay silent, it's a freeze frame. My arm hurts. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough of that.